Yeah. Now, remember, this is just the four, and, and I'm just loosely going through the line and connecting the two that I had right here. See. And what this does is using different kind of uh, needle shades, uh, dimensions rather. You see how I'm going with the yeah, green? Yeah, yeah, see how the hair is? Yeah, I've, already, yeah. I've already figured out where the point is. So right here, I'm going with the green of his hair. This is something that I developed years ago, going with the direction of the hair. So it's, especially for guys that want to shave against the green. You see this? Look at that. Let me just fill in that little head right there. So once I do the 04 here, what I'll do is I'll switch it back to 05. See how I'm doing my five of dice right there? Yeah, yeah, I see that. You see that? See how important that is to do that? Oh, yeah. I'm not even gonna wipe it down this way. But hey, Juan, check this out. I don't know. So right now, remember I got the 04, which I just wanna go through and, and feather some of the line out with the 04s now. Characteristics. Yeah, just a little bit. Yeah, just lightly right there to give it a nice super you just want to make sure it blends into his natural hair perfectly seamlessly see how Doc is going he's not hitting a hair follicle he's going right between those faces yeah. yep like I'm not hitting yeah because you don't want to darken up the actual hair like right here especially in the front it's like I aim and then I don't hit that part that's, that's what I'm telling you because you know what it is we can control the position of it that's what I'm telling you, don't attack it, that takes time. Look at these little ones I'm putting on, the very, very feathered. Yeah, right there. Again, come back here, I'm going to fill in some of the five of dice. Right, you're doing the flower right there, 